Hello, welcome to this video. Today we are going to see quizzes. It is a fantastic and uh, interactive assessment tool. This tool can be used in your classroom in a variety of applications and we can give small tests, small quizzes in a different way as a competition and we can maintain the timings, how extend, how they are doing in a quicker way. So these are various aspects are there, very interesting tool. Uh, so I'm also very anxiety to take you to take into the, the quizzes. Go to the quizzes, quizizizz.com is the website name and click enter. So the browse bar will take us to these quizzes, the quizzy website. So this is the uh, on the front console, the main page of the website. So if you want to take this tool for your work as a corporate applications, you can go with this or for your schools, you can click on this. And this side, you can see the join in the game. This is generally taken by the students. You can create a quiz or a game, the quiz as a game here. So they can join the game by clicking this, by giving. Uh, the code which you are uh, going to share with the students the link okay so if you have account you can click on this so that it will be uh, you can get into your account this one is the initial if you don't have any account you can click on this you can invite the parents also parents or friends also into the quiz along with the students and here what are the many subjects are there even english or mathematics or social you just think all the subject will be here an interactive very amazing tool we'll see that so these are the tools these are the subject various subject you can have the test in the different subject if you are creating an innovative quiz if you are satisfied if you want to share with others you can bring it to the library so that others also can use your quiz okay and uh, see how it is working these are all simply other information you just explore yourself in your laser time now i am going to have you see i'm not at all logging in just i'm going to get started okay i get started here welcome to quizzes you can give your email id and it will be taking to the other thing i'm going back i will show you how to log in first okay so first i am giving sign up just for the uh, to show you the other credentials also will be taken simply just like the other uh, and the initial stages no so easily you can get rid of that so once if you have the account you can that is not a big issue so that is what i'm uh, not taking much more time by giving the signing up okay signing up process is very simple anyone can easily signing up by giving the email id and the name the minimum information okay so now i am getting into the login so here i am giving my login email id i have already given on email id so these quizzes okay so i used that email id to get into the quiz here you can see the right side this is my page this is my account okay so if you want to change your information you can change by going to the right extreme the three small bars are there you no know? you just click that you can see uh, this is the nickname i have given the nickname just like that the username you can give according to you so that can be set by clicking that setting see this setting you can give the author means you can choose any one of the symbols just like an icon okay for example it's already there i am taking this one okay the guitar and I click this so that symbol will be adopted as the author and you can give the, see here it is the kalyan classroom this is my youtube channel Kalyan classroom so that I represent here otherwise you can give some other thing okay so that is up to you and here is the name and the grade so which grade you want to uh, take so for university or 12th grade or kindergarten you see from kindergarten to university there you can pick up any one of the your choice according to your choice and the language also is there you just come down game settings so this is the background music while the quiz is going on here the quiz or game one is the same okay don't get confused so the background music also will be playing and sound effects so sound effects 
checking if you are selecting the right answer one kind of music if you are selecting choosing the wrong answers another kind of just like that some innovative some smaller to encourage the students and the memes so in the same way some pictures will be showing and this one is a read aloud the questions will be realer the questions will be read by a male voice so that easily you can understand you need not read on your own just okay so i am selecting this we will see and this is the game themes you can choose any one of that just for that and account settings here you can use update the password or delete account this is for the logout so logout also available here just a click you can set you can click on the logout for uh, logging out okay now if you want to come to the main screen just click this here the home button so this is the home place this is the activity already any activity done in this account you can see those activities so in this account already i did some activity so that is what it is showing here okay i am coming back to the activity screen mm, right so here the find is there what we can find for example i want to select one of the already existed quiz or existed game created by some other teachers somewhere in the subject of biology i am selecting biology i am typing biology and click this lens it will be showing the various quizzes in the given the term biology you see top results for biology you just scroll it down you can see more and more the created games right so in this games one thing you can understand see here you can see notice that 10 questions 2k plays so 2000 people already used this the quiz game here you see these consist of 15 questions and 1k plays and top you see this is the 2k plays 10 questions 10 questions 10k plays so 10000 people used this biology okay so this quiz like that you can come down you see the 2k place so that is how you just see that and how many plays and how many questions depends upon your requirement you can do that if you are creating a quiz like this that also can be if you are sharing that also will be taken place in this collection okay so that addings the many people also will be adding many people also will be uh, using that uh, quiz so this number also will be count as you know this thing okay for example i am selecting human body I just click this and uh, proceed carefully this quiz was marked inappropriate for students below 13 years by an okay so why necessarily okay i am coming back we will take some other thing okay so this is 10 questions 8k place we will select this right no restriction i think so challenge friends so if you are selecting challenge you can extend you can invite the students so among the students among the friends you can have some competition kind of the challenge kind of uh, the game everybody will be entering into the quiz at the same time we can notice we can monitor who will be attending very fast just like a rapid quiz also can be completed um, conducted here so this one is a practice test you can click and you can see this is the practice test and you see the play quiz here is the questions that we have already taken no so that information created by this is the name and this is the flashcards just like a uh, the records if you are clicking that it will be showing the information so this is how uh, the flashcards will be working we can read and you can click this you see if you are sorting that the 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 cards will be see here you can see number of cards you can see the options you can choose it is coming to the next question if you want to see you can see the contents you can review you can flip like that so this is how this option the flashcards will be working this also a kind of motivating the students in a different way biology and click on this okay now we'll see maths maths and click on this this is the mathematics okay you can choose mathematics this is 10 questions 365 plays here is a 2k place 10 questions let us try this 
and you see I'm clicking in the practice already we tried this flash flashcards right now we will see the play quiz so this is a meme and counting down now we can start our quiz. question see free answer this sorry, is the background music and this is the question option one free option two free option three free option four free you can choose any one of the answer you can submit it see this is an incorrect answer now let's see here we can see 10 questions one has completed this is the meme and we are coming to the scroll to scoreboard now we are coming 10. to the second question option 1 40 okay so this is showing the progress second question question is the score 10 times 10 see 930 option 1 30 option 2 200 okay option 3 100 option 4 okay like that it is going on you can stop the music or you can proceedings you can proceed question the fourth what question are you in? randomly it is going on right so i'm closing this i'm going back i'm closing this i don't want to continue uh, and here this is a challenge friends challenge friends listen just click that see this is the timer if you are giving timer by default it uh, the quiz is eh, giving 30 seconds to attend each questions you can select the timer so that we can see how we extend the the students are speed the speed fetching you 400 marks the correct answer fetching you 600 marks altogether thousand marks thousand points will be given to each questions so that is why you are noticing hundreds of marks coming right so this memes also can be stopped or uh, this read aloud the voice also we can stop the timer also we can stop if you are stopping the timer thousand marks will be given to the right answer and this is the power ups so here if you are completing automatically the next question will be simply moving around with the memes around so this is a power up and in between some some boosting signals also will be there just like a uh, video games that also can be taken so these are the settings according to your feasibility you can set that okay and here these are the themes you can set the themes okay so i am closing this down we are going back still we are not at started our uh, the quiz now i am going to show as the admin panel here you can see and one more thing you can click on the create quiz you just click that so that we can create new quiz now first of all we should give the name right so what we can give uh, the test Kalyan for easy understanding and choose the relevant subject what subject you want to take any subject science English more still you can click more you can these are other subjects also available life skills journalism uh, then industrial technology architecture business still you can click other okay so these are the various subject you can choose relatively is a religious studies so relatively you can ask questions i am selecting mm, computers and click next now see what are the types of questions we can add multiple choices check boxes fill in the blanks the polls open ended question descriptive kind of so these are the various kinds of the questions we can accommodate right now here is some settings also is there in your uh, quiz if you want to add any image you can add and the test color the test name also here here you see here you can notice 30 seconds default time for each question will be 30 seconds time will be given and so these are the grades if you want to add seventh grade or a degree uh, university you can choose that degree okay here you can choose the degree first second or i am selecting university okay and the public to everyone or private if you are using public you are created can be seen you are created a quiz game can be used by others it will be easily accessible from uh, by others if you are using private it will be restricted to only you right and you should give the links to others to use that and other computers assign the standards so these are the things you can see and set up right and now i'm going to use one question 
see I am selecting multiple this is the panel here you can add the question that will be counted as the first one you can add the mathematical functions mathematical formula so these are the various things you can do while writing the question what is your name right and uh, option you can give some options after that you see for example i am giving and or not kalyan so out of these four questions which one is right you have to click that you make that right answer and each question if you want to add some images you can add that okay and uh, this one is uh, by default it's a 30 seconds if you want to give the less time you can use a less timing that is up to you and you can save this see here what the question we are typing that is transferred to this panel you can say save that is saved see that question is added here now we are going to add the next one here it is the checkbox you just click the checkbox you can add some other question and you can save this okay so like that you can go on add questions clear after that you can click on done and you can save this you can save this before that it is asking the the grade you can choose the grades and save if there is anything is required it will ask otherwise you go with that now see test kalyan also come to our created quizzes if you want to float this you can click this and this is the test kalyan practice test or challenge friends you can click the you can click this challenge before that you see this is a share and edit if you want to edit more you can do that if you want to share you can click this link and you can copy the link you can share with your colleagues or your students okay here also you see the challenge it is coming to this panel if you are clicking the channel we are coming to here and the start game you go with this you just start with this here you can use the background music sound effect memes read aloud i am suppressing i am unchecked the read aloud only sound effect will be there start game if you are clicking the start game it is coming here now we are getting the code so this code you can copy you can share it to your friends or students or anybody else or share a direct link you can take this this link can be directly you can pass it to your friends like that we can invite the students so this is the code of this game okay and there is no participants if you are sharing that many people also will be adding in the uh, the created piece you can see number of participants right now i am going to show i am deleting this i am coming out are you sure you want to exit the game yes i am coming out now already we have created something so that i want to take i want to show it to you so instead i want to go to the admin see go to the browse bar you just give the admin quizy.com slash admin you just add a slash and admin and click enter now the same account but we are getting into the admin rights and this one we just I click this as information see here now we are getting into the admin panel this is the name this is the profile you can see the profile you want to create the quiz you can use this create button so this one is a search bar you can use the search bar to search some other any other quizzes in subject this is the library so these are the quizzes created by me and kept as a library for myself okay so this information if you are putting as a public any others also can view this and this is the reports the conducted test the conducted test responses and uh, it is accuracy it's accuracy all those things are there these are the reports if you want to take the printout or if you want to download into csv file or excel format you can make use of that for example this one is a total player 8 i am clicking this i can see uh, the students performance right so this is the 100% secure 100% attended this student attended 
only one attempt you can notice here only one attempt these students see three attempts and 100 percent accuracy the total score is 12,000 right you can email it to the student to the students parents and here if you want to delete this you can delete if you want to take the printout you can take the printout if you want to expand in the sense it will be showing in the full screen so this is how we can see that and this the table this result we can see score wise otherwise accuracy wise or first name wise you see first name name wise and this is the last name wise that's up to you just you can see and you can take the printout and if you want to make a download you just click this download the excel file will be downloading you see this is the excel file enable editing this is the file and here you can see all the questions so what are the questions how many questions these questions and their correct answers how many correct answers done by the student i'm minimizing so that we can accommodate all data see these students uh, what is the student name this student this is the student's name right this student attended three times see one twice thrice right so this student just a minute see this student attended five correct answers one is incorrect one is unattempted so totally how many eight questions right so here we can see their responses okay so this is how and their score also given over here so this is the place we can see their outcome after downloading okay All right now we are going to see we are going to float one test this is the collection already we notice the library right this is the collection and this is the memes we created this meme you see this meme just you can click on this you can create your beam okay and just click this it will be asking from where you want to bring the image you just bring the image that image memes also can be keep as a public or private that is up to you you can do that okay so this is how it will be accommodating here uh, next one is a setting already we noticed the setting what we can do and this is for logout and this is you can extend to your friends right now i am showing this library okay i will opening i will show you and uh, this quizzes you can share it as a assignment also you just see I am clicking the assignment of homework and when do you want to attend this quiz by your students you can select the date today's date is 20 you can assign this should be completed before 21st you are giving 22nd otherwise 23rd how many days you want to give the time to attend this quiz weekend quiz Saturday Sunday okay like that you can assign some dates end date we cannot give the start date and the time also you can mention okay and you can simply say continue for example i am selecting this one is 20 today and uh, this is the what is the time the time is now 9:57. now i am going to um, 30 or uh, okay 15 only 15 minutes okay and this one is a uh, okay we will keep it as 10 30 and this is a right so 32 minutes from now this should be completed and still some other settings also is there that is gentle settings uh, this is unlimited or how many times you are permitting the students to attend the same test that is here if you are giving only once all the students anybody can attend only once they cannot give the same test for the second time uh, so this one is a show answers in game answers also will be showing in the same screen after completion of their quiz and the score also will be showing instantly after the one by one question each from after completion of each question they can see their score in between okay so that you can on or you can make it as off and uh, power ups the students get bonus points and other fun abilities if you are uh, going in a good way the bonus points also will be added that is the power ups you can use these otherwise you cannot you simply you can uh, suppress this because this bonus will be making some images will be revolving otherwise uh, simply rounding in your uh, disturb the attention so that is why suppress is a good way and the timer if you are giving timer 
the quick response also fetching 400 accuracy also fetching 600 if you are off, uh, uncheck the timer all 1000 points will be given to the same question we will see the accuracy point also so that the speediness of the students also can be measured so this is a leaderboard the complete screen will be showing their performance and uh, shuffle questions the questions order will be shuffling the answers also will be shuffling so these are the play of this is a play, play music show memes so these are the various options so let us go with the default and uh, i am simply telling continue the time is only 10 30. now you see this is the way you can invite simply by clicking you can give this code to your google classroom you can invite you can share this link to your google classroom students also they can attend this right so this is the we can do that and uh, if we want to attend the students see this is the link the link copied share the share page you can share and paste it uh, to your channel and enter the enter this code see i am copying this we can go to the reports so the started two minutes ago total players already 23 players are there you just click this we are coming to this screen and we can see the questions or we can see the view here the students are attending and one more in the way i am going to the library and i am selecting the same one the same question and i am going to live i am giving taste and this one is a team this one is a classic this one is a taste it requires login this one is a classic way students answer at their own face if you are starting today or one hour two hour according to their time they can attend this one is a team the students answer at their own pace but scores are grouped by team okay so team by team any member of the team can attend any time but the more points will be given as a team wise now we are going to the test and these are the test settings i can continue if you are continuing again the code will be coming now we can take this now see i can start this so this one is the assignment this one is assignment we have to go to the report so that we can see the uh, the students six minutes ago you click that 90 students are there all the 90 students are giving their assignments so this is how the students are doing right this is assignment but if you are coming to here we are starting that we are starting that no players currently we will see how the students are joining okay so once you are conducting the test automatically you can see that see this is how the things will be going on in case of test the background music also will be there Here you can see the test is going on. So this is how the students are doing the test. We can see the maximum students or if you want to see only 5, we can see the top 5 students. And this is how 90 students attended the assignments. You can see how the students attended. I am stopping this. So stop this you can I am stopping this end game end game right I stopped this okay all done so this is how the test also can be done and the students also will be happily attending see this is the output this is a preview you can show the time taken and email all participants if their email id is there you can email that you can see the questions as well as 
their score 19 correct 7 incorrect 13 seconds this is the average time taken so you can mention you can see that the toughness of the questions so this is how we can see the average seconds of the questions and you can download the results you just click the download see here we can see enable editing this is the excel format you can download you can see how many student attended all these things will be available with the name list here see these are the responses and their correct answers and incorrect answers and attempted this is the assignments the assignments also if you are giving a timings for saturday and sunday or a end time they can attend so accuracy and the questions and the players attempted so 90 students attended and these are the questions you can see the questions and uh, four players the four percentage is so this one this question this a choice chosen by the four players the 10 students taken this as the resume as the second one so 7 to 11 percentage so you can see that and unattempted 70 players did not attempted this question and this is how you can analyze each and every questions and how the students are doing and where you have to teach the remaining things. So students engage at their own pace and easily teacher can understand that what students knows now and where you will take them next. So this is how we can analyze the students. I And uh, we discuss the complete I think. I hope for this uh, the quiz the tool will be very helpful for you uh, very helpful uh, for taking your class in an interesting way thank you for uh, listening